Okay, so you we just created the warehouse in our last video. In this video, we want to like bring in like some lake house data, but uh, we're gonna do that through a unique, awesome way about like creating a lake house in the same workspace and then leveraging shortcuts to data someplace else that we're then gonna use in a, in, a, in the next video. Oh, this is so exciting! I can't wait to show you more about how this works. All right, make sure you do the whole YouTube thing, like, subscribe, leave comments, all that good stuff. Uh, we got links down below for our, our partner, like affiliate sponsor, uh, 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 HexCloud. So go over, check out that HexCloud stuff too. It's pretty cool. It, it's pretty cool. All right, so uh, let's get into it. We are in our uh, Kratos warehouse where we've got our warehouse created that we did in the last video. Uh, uh, now we're gonna create a new lake house in here to get uh, not, so this this warehouse has reseller data in it. We're gonna use the lake house to get uh, internet sales information into the same workspace. So I'm gonna say new item, and I'm gonna go over to my, uh, my new item th uh, panel. I'm gonna type in lake house or just lake, I'm gonna choose my lake house option, and then I'm gonna call this one uh, Kratos BI uh, Internet Sales LH, okay? I'm gonna use my lake house schemas, I'm gonna click on create. This is then gonna go ahead and create my lake house, like boom, <laughs> already my lake house is available for me, okay? Now, uh, once I've got that crate, uh, created, I'm going to head over. Uh, I've got my lake house. I've got the tables and my DBO schema. I'm just going to go on this little ellipsis. I'm going to click on new table shortcut. Wait, new table shortcut. And I'm going to choose where my data is. In this case, my data is in Microsoft One Lake. So I'm going to select that. And I want to pull it from my endorsed data warehouse that my enterprise has. So I'm going to sort by my endorsements to find uh, the one that I'm looking for. I think I can also like filter down on stuff or I could just look at the endorsed one so my list becomes smaller. Uh, in this case, I'm going to be going for my advent my certified AdventureWorks Lakehouse. I'm going to choose that one and click on next. Okay. Now it's going to ask me like, what do I want to pull in? Well, this is very simple. I got a couple things I'm gonna to wanna to be bringing together. I want some conforming dimensions between what's in my resellers and in my uh, uh, that's in my internet sales. So I want my date dimension and I want my product dimension as well. And then I'm gonna choose my fact internet sales. I'm gonna make those selections. I'm gonna click on next. It's gonna kind of give me a little prompting yet. Uh, like, okay, hey, here are the items that we're gonna be pulling in so it's these uh it, it, it's it's these tables the source is going to be right here for this information and it's going to give me the status now i can go through and i could rename these things if i wanted to like i could click on the edit and i could give it a different name uh some people like that so that like when they're looking at something they they can know where it's coming from that's not theirs or something like that uh, I'm just going to keep things simple. I'm going to leave them the exact same name of the objects that we're using. So I'm going to think, click on create. And boom, I've got these tables are now available for me. Let's see here, dim date. Come on. It take a little bit for like this whole, the, the linking and syncing to occur. So you're going to get a preview. Come on, refresh this puppy. There we go. We've got our uh, dim date. I go to my dim products. I see that come through. That looks good. And my factor internet sales, uh, that's going to come through as well. Boom. All right. Now, if I go back to my workspace, I could see that in the exact same environment that my Kratos BI warehouse was in, I now have a lake house. So both of these are together in the same place. Uh, at least the definitions are. The data hasn't moved on the lake house side. Okay, the lake house data is still those delta files are in one lake. There's just shortcut it in. All right. In the next video, we're gonna do a we're gonna show you how you can use these together. Not just the warehouse, not just the lake house, but put them both together. Uh, I am super pumped and excited about that one. Ah. Uh, 
insight and advanced technical expertise to uncover and solve your digital transformation challenge. If you're interested in learning more, check out our website at makeitdigitally.com business. 